IB Physics, May 2025, Time Zone 2, SLF Paper 1A, Question 2. The variation with time t of the acceleration a of an object is shown. At t is equal to 0, the object is at rest. So that means that our initial velocity is equal to 0 meters per second. Now the question is, what is the speed of the object when t is equal to 8 seconds? Well, speed is the scalar magnitude of velocity. And in order to find the velocity, we need to look at the graph. Whenever I look at the graph, I also like to check the units. So we have meters per second squared and seconds. So I realized that when we multiply the two, we will get the unit for velocity. What this means is that velocity as some function of t is equal to the initial velocity plus the integral from zero to t of the acceleration as some function of t dt. So for our case, we're trying to find the velocity at t is equal to eight seconds. And our initial velocity is zero, so we can substitute that in. That means the velocity at 8 seconds is just the integral from 0 to 8 of the acceleration dt. Well, this here is just the area of the graph, and the area is relatively easy to find. We have the area of a triangle from 0 to 8. That'll be 8 times 8 divided by 2, which is equal to 32 meters per second. So that's the velocity, and that means that the speed is 32 meters per second at 8 seconds. So the answer is B. Now we could, we could have uh, just taken the integral, because acceleration as a function of time is equal to T. So if we do that, we have the integral from 0 to 8 of T dt. So we have T squared divided by 2 evaluated from 0 to 8, which will give us 8 squared divided by 2, which is also equal to 32 meters per second, so that verifies our answer as answer choice B.